be living with my mom, being broke, 19 years old. I don't have the attractive traits that women are looking for. Yeah, correct. Okay. So what if I told you that you being 30 years old, being a former stripper, doing OnlyFans is the same exact thing as that 19 year old living with his mom? No, hold on. Let us sink in. Wait, hold on. See, let us sink in. I'm not attractive for being a loser, rightfully so. I don't deserve a bad bitch and a wife. Same thing with you. 30 years old, OnlyFans, being a stripper, same thing. That's not what a man that you want making a million dollars a year is going to want in return. That's all I'm telling you. You triggered my trap card. You have to, when, you, when you're looking at like dating the opposite gender, you have to think about what the other gender wants. I don't show up on a date with my dick out for a reason. Because I do, I do want to have sex with a girl. I understand that I need to build rapport. I need to be attractive. I got to make her laugh a little bit. I got to come smelling, smelling good. I got to dress good. I got to set up a date. I got to properly do things for her to be attracted to me. Why is it that when I tell women, well, you should probably do the things that the man that you want wants from you. But girls say, no, I'm not ready and I'm not going to do that. That's like me, me, me being 19 years old, living with my mom and saying, I demand the bad bitch. See how delusional I sound? But the thing is, but like... Sorry. Does that make sense? Yes, it makes sense. Sure. It definitely makes sense. The thing is, I'm 24 years old. I'm not looking for a husband right now. Like, I don't... Bruh. These qualities, Keep like... Keep it on to the Yes. I understand that you're not looking for a man now, but you do understand... And I, and Hold I'm on. Stop. Stop. Streets, Stop for two I, seconds. I Stop for two seconds. Friend, Stop like, for two seconds. Stop for two for seconds. At 24 years old, you have more negotiating power to get a man than you do at 30 years old. Mm -hmm. Do you understand that concept at least? No. Yes. Okay. I do understand that concept. The thing is, me, myself, sure. me... Go ahead. I you got don't want to get married right now. I don't want to get married. I don't want to have kids right now. I just don't. Right now, I don't want to do it at 24 years okay. old. Okay, and that's okay. fine. But you're shooting okay. yourself in the foot in the future to find the guy that you want. Because you're purposely, essentially, just letting the mileage run up without getting an owner. I don't mean to sound crass like that, but that's really the simplest way I could put it. Uh, because just, men look at women yeah. as cars. The lower the odometer, the more attractive you are. The higher the odometer, the less attractive you are. And then also another thing with your boyfriend that you mentioned. So at the top of the show, I asked you, what's your relationship status? And you said single, correct? Uh, uh, I don't think I answered. Did I answer that? Yeah, you did. You said you were single. And I think that's very important. Don't because I could tell a lot about a woman when I ask her about Is her I relationship you? status. If a girl tells me she's single or something like that, and then she comes back later and says she has a man to kind of save face. She's a liar. Uh, uh, it's not that she's a liar. I believe her that she has a man. She just doesn't like him like that. And the reason why is because you refer to him as a slave. No woman wants a man that she can actually call a slave. Like, a girl wants a guy that if she dared say she, he, she, he's a slave, he would break up with her. A woman wants a guy with a backbone. Whenever a girl can emasculate a man like that and call him a slave or whatever, she wears the pants of the relationship and she don't respect him, which literally was shown earlier when I asked you if, you have a, if you're single and you said single. I literally wear the pants. Yeah, that's the problem. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, cool. here's the thing. I don't know what to... Uh, that's, that's the way it so, should So, like, is. notice how, know. real quick, when I asked her... What she did for work, she led with her relationship. She didn't even, I didn't even ask her what her relationship was. She said, I'm a stay-at-home wife. Women that have a man that they actually respect and admire are proud to show that shit off. Because women know that their value is contingent upon the man they can attract. So the guy you're with, you don't respect him. You just tolerate him for now. So, I don't know, man. I think you need to really reevaluate how you do things if you want to get your dream guy. Like I, That's the thing, though. You guys keep talking about a dream guy. I'm not... I, that's not like why do people just care about your dream guy I have other goals and other things to that I want to do and aspire to do like like, what? like a guy like, like I, already, I already met like I already met like a million guys like yeah. you know what I mean so I just don't oh my like that's not my thing right now no, 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 that's fine that's fine that's fine I'm just saying when, I think when I'm that's... ready like I already did that was I did all the good things I was loyal like da 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 like I You're stayed at home loyal. like I was actually I was. engaged when I was 21 years old to a guy from New York that I was with for three years but then I'm like bro like what am I doing with my life like this is not okay like I, this You're this is married. like a fairy tale yeah. so that so that I can get a divorce like when I'm 32 like ever. it just doesn't How make sense just like she got married at 23 that shit doesn't work out bro this is not I, 1932 I this is not 1920s anymore go ahead you want to you want to respond go ahead, go ahead. You respond. I did get married at 23 I was also kind of pressured into it I almost didn't walk down the aisle. I knew he was the wrong guy for me. We had 400 people at our wedding. Big 400? Catholic, huh? 400? Yeah. Wow, that's awesome. Big, huge Roman Catholic wedding. That's a lot of pressure. Both families. I was told I had to go through with it. 
and I was told I couldn't get divorced because we were Roman Catholic. Can I um, butt in also? Yes. I want to say that like a lot of women in the sex worker industry or in the OnlyFans industry do have a different type of upbringing than a lot of other women. So maybe where she was at at like 21 versus where you were at at 23 might have been different mentally. You know what I'm saying? She I mean, and I, I mean, I've judge you, but had also, a fairly she good didn't upbringing. Judge her. She judged the fuck out of her. Right. I'm not judging her. It's just what happened. It's the Ask facts. The tape. The she tape got says married at 23, and it did, I just know that that's gonna happen to me if I get married right now. It's not gonna work it's forever. It's about choosing the right guy, though. Exactly. I didn't find the right guy, and I don't know what the right guy is. And I, I, I just don't know what the right but guy you're is. But you also looking for a guy that drink. Drink. That's the most honest shit she said the entire yeah. time. Well, I was gonna say. And I can respect. Hold, that. hold on. I have a question I for think, you. I think women need to get married or get in a serious relationship as young as as Why are none of you? Are you 24? Yeah. Imagine buying your G wagon six years after somebody drove that car. Would you want that car still? No. So you being 30, why should, why would you want you? You guys are you guys are literally the men that I know like that ain't shit. Like you guys are literally the men that I know ain't shit. Like are you a man? No, but I know I first of all I know you know niggas in the club that ain't shit can last 50, 60 years and never find a girl. But can you? Who says I can? We just did, went through this. Okay, I can last without a man. Like, like she said, I went eight months celibate. Like, I can eight last months? without a man. That's, cat, bro. That's true. That's cat, bro. I think you're missing the point that men mm-hmm. men no. age like like wine, women age like milk. As that's you get true. older, your your chances of finding a man go down. Then As we get older, my, our chances then, go up. Then, then pour yeah. me oh, in, in a not few the years. They're like not the I same. feel bad for myself in a few years. I don't know. Facts, like, yeah, facts. It's, it's not yeah, the same. like pray yeah. for me, guys. I don't know what to nah, say. Nah, man, you no. all. It's not the same, but I will say that, like you said, like it's probably better to have women get married at a younger age as young because, as you the, can. right? Because like the further you get and the deeper you get into this type of game, it becomes very, very difficult. One, your viewpoint and your standpoint on marriage and men in general just changes from being in this field. Yeah. So I can understand where she's at because I empathize because I'm in the same field, but yeah, it's like we. But see how she's not able to come to the same logically sound though. conclusion yeah. though. Like mm-hmm. she's not able to come to the same conclusion. She lives in reality, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on, you got a point? Because she's saying men and women are different, though, because, like, at 40, you'll see a woman, and she's like, oh, she's beautiful for her age. A man at 40, he's fine as hell still. Yeah. 50, same. A woman at 50, oh, she why are you not married that, at 50? Bro. That's a red flag. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> like, that's crazy. Yeah, I, I mean, there's like, Why a... would I get you at 50 and nobody else did at 50? That's crazy. Dang. There's a term in China, right? Uh, for Shenyu. for women that are oh, right. I, well, it, it, historically it was 25 Calm years down. or older, but then it's they moved it kind of more to like 27 and older or 30 and older. It's called Sheng Nu, which is basically means leftover woman in Chinese. Oh wow! Um, <laughs> and I don't say that to like be an asshole or it's be true, misogynistic, but I say that to say universally, whether Chinese, American, Arab, etc. Since the beginning of time, men have always valued younger women. Because mm-hmm. of fertility and youth and beauty, and that's, these are things we look for, right? So, um, I think women need to understand that this is how men evaluate women. It's not your career or having a bag or any of this other stuff, and they need to kind of adopt to what men want. Like, and I think, not to pick on you, but like she said, why why should I care what the man wants? And I think a lot of girls have that mantra: so of, why marry. should I care what the man wants? But if a woman get, wants to get married or get taken seriously. I think it's very important for them to understand what men want and what men are attracted to. Yes, and ahead, also, uh-huh. and then ahead. and then you can go unless go you want her to go. You want to go? Yes, go sure. ahead, go first. Well, I was always, I was just guys. We're gonna switch to Castle like... Club too, by the way. Uh, yeah, guys, come on over to CastleClub.tv yeah. yeah. right now. Yeah, we're gonna switch right now and then close out there. So come on over, guys. Come on over. I know Castle some of y'all gonna TV. cry in the chat, but hey, CastleClub.tv. It is what it is, man. Come on over. Ten thousand strong, part of the team.